Hello and welcome to an episode of AVR Gaming. My name's Jacob and today I'm gonna try and build a Minecraft tank live on camera for you guys. So I'm just gonna basically just make up a new design of tank. So I've already kind of started off with like this weird shape here. Uh, what am I doing? And we're just gonna basically build off from this and see what we can come up with. Uh, the reason being is, as you can see behind us, um, the big elephant in the room, or rather the big die building, <laughs> uh, is there. And I'm thinking of building a big Godzilla here to be smashing this building. So I wanted to add some tanks, just because, you know, where there's Godzilla, there's generally tanks, right? Uh, so we're going to be building a thing. And I just started building this, so I'm like, you know what, maybe I can do a video on it. So why the hell not? Uh... So basically how I started this is, of course, I just laid down some... So how wide do we want to make this thing? I think we want to have a central turret that's kind of like running down the middle. So it'd be best to have it be... We have a three wide... Could either be... This wide, or we can add two more. Yeah, let's build a big chunker of a tank. <laughs> Why not? We'll see. We can always change it up. So what I did is I laid down some of this because I wanted to have like a a section of tires running under it. Actually, so you know what? I'm gonna build this somewhere else, just because I have an idea. So bear with me, guys. I'll probably have to destroy this and move this somewhere else, but. Yeah, there we go. So now the reason I have to do this is because I really want to use these as the wheels. And it's really difficult to have like a good set of the caterpillar track, like the, the actual sort of caterpillar rubber or whatever it is that moves around. I don't think it's actually rubber on tanks, it's probably some other more hardy material that just has hinges in it, but you know, you know what I mean. So, the downside of this design is it's going to have to be on a raised platform, so if you have a road that isn't made of half slabs, you're kind of screwed. But, you know what, may as well try it out as a design, see how it goes. Does that look okay, or do we just want to do that? That's never going to be perfect, so we'll just go with that. But yeah, that looks a little bit better, because now it actually has the, the bottom part. Yeah, I like that, okay. And what I'm thinking, originally I was going to do something like this, but we could actually have it go lower, but uh, for now we'll just leave it as so. so I'm going to make this tank green. We don't really have that many decent green blocks that have like stairs. We have, um, we have, you know, these, this prismarine ones, but they're a little bit, I don't know, we'll, we'll, we'll pull some out, see if we can use them. Oops. The texture on them might not be the best because it's kind of thinking of doing something like that I don't even have a particular design in mind I just want to make like a, a very stereotypical sort of tank I've seen a bunch of designs but and I wasn't really sold on a lot of them so I wanted to kind of try and build my own especially since I uh, didn't see many people using these blocks no. kind of want that to go more like there there we go uh, the reason I'm not um, using these like this way is they kind of merge together. And that helps kind of break it up more. But you can experiment with that however you will. Now on top of here, maybe we'll actually use the green terracotta to kind of separate it a little bit. Yeah, that works. I haven't really decided where the front is. Perhaps this will be the front. Oh, yeah, that, that'll be good. So I've seen a few different designs for the gun turret. Usually they involve using these things. So we'll try this one because uh, it is also green. So <laughs> that could work. It's, it's a little goofy looking, but that's kind of... You don't have much of an option when you're doing these in Minecraft. Yeah, added some of that around there. Okay. Okay. Uh, I feel the need to add some details around here, because I'm just messing this up, aren't I? 
Okay. Uh, when you have to press shift to do stuff like that, it gets a bit tedious. But those could be like little hatches or lights or whatever. Uh, we probably want to put like a hatch here. I'm probably not going to use that design. Um, actually, the other ones aren't that much better, if I'm going to be all entirely honest. I don't know, guys. At the moment, I'm just kind of messing around with stuff. But, as you can see, we've kind of got a tank now, and it's sort of coming together. So, from a distance, which with all Minecraft things is kind of where you have to observe them, does resemble a tank. Maybe it will look a little bit better, even though I like the texture of this at the top, if we do something like this. You can add us some antennas onto it, because, you know, they usually have like a little antenna up the back that does stuff. And we could finish off the other caterpillar track, as I bet all of you are screaming at me in the comments. Actually, the time that I'm uh, filming this video, it is the Lunar New Year's uh, Day, so or the Chinese New Year. Um, Lunar New Year in the in Vietnam, because my girlfriend's Vietnamese, so I hear about that occasionally. But thinks people are having a party down the street because I can hear music, so I don't know if you guys can hear it, but I wonder if it's for that occasion. Actually, today we had the most bizarre thing. We had a swarm of bees. I think it's still there, um, lesser though, uh, in front of our house in the win at the window, right in front of our kitchen. It was like hundreds of bees just around the house. It was really weird, so I hope that doesn't become a recurring problem. But anyway, that's the build so far. Not looking too bad. I still don't really like the way the, the that we have to use this texture for the green slabs, but I, I'm not going to get like a texture pack or anything for anything like this, because that's just extreme. I like working in vanilla Minecraft, because it, especially for the these videos, because that way it really helps videos kind of be more relatable to people, because most people just play using normal texture pack. And here I'm just kind of experimenting with different shapes we can do for like the top here to round it out a bit, and that actually looks pretty good. So, yeah, that could be a cool little hatch that you can go in and out of. Might even look better if we put it like there. Yeah, yeah, it's coming along. We could put like little windows in here, but like very small ones, because tanks do tend to... They, they have windows and little peepholes, but they are really small, uh, so they can't be shot into, of course. So that's what that's for. Okay. There we go. So we have, like, little windows. I don't know if they're too big, but, you know, of course, they're also the wrong color, but that's, you know, what can you do? I wish we had trapdoors of, like, every color. I'm all about diversity in my trapdoors, you guys. <laughs> no, I just really want, um... I just, eh, I don't know how I feel about that. It could work at the tip. But I just want to have, like, all the building materials available. I, I wish we could have get stairs and, um... These sort of blocks of every single block in Minecraft that the crafting recipes would be simple and they'd made, make sense. And anything we can do with these, like... I think I've seen tanks with like weird shit up the back like that. Not that I see a lot of tanks or anything in my day-to-day -day life, it's just... Kind of trying to just get ideas, actually. Yeah, look at that! There's like the... The axle into the wheels there. I'm a freaking genius, look at that. That's a lot better, okay. See, I like it when, <laughs> when I just, you know, I... I I spend time just mucking about with blocks until I think of something like that, and I'm like, yeah, that's kind of cool, I'll use that. So, uh, just a way of kind of making it look like there's more machinery-esque stuff going on behind the wheels here is always a good thing. So I'm just gonna break the ground this tank is built on for now, just so I can really get down here and do some stuff. And sorry if, um, because I bet a lot of people just want, like, a really simple, like, this is the finished product, this is how you build it, thanks for watching the tutorial, but no, nah, I'm just like, let's watch me fumble around for half an hour until I make a tank look half decent. But, you know, if you want 
you know, if you want more tutorials on anything else and like less janky ones than this, then yeah, let me know <laughs> in the comments below and maybe I will um, do that more in the future. What do you guys think? It's coming along okay. Not really sure how to close this off. Maybe we'll just do more of these. I don't know if that looks any good or not, but we're going to cover it up with signs. Looks a little bit flat now, so... Plonk and plonk. Don't know how I feel about it, but I will probably just get some... Cyan. That seems to be a good color for to match up with um, these. That's what I tend to use, cyan terracotta or... Grey concrete is also okay. That's a bit dark. And that'll um, just help fill in this area because there's not much more we could really do here. Jeez, it's hot by the way. Um, I say this in all my recent videos, but I live in Australia and it is summer and it is nightmarishly hot recently. So I do apologize if I look like I've come out of a sauna. I'm not entirely sure I'm happy with it, but I'm not unhappy with it. It's just kind of okay at the moment to me. <laughs> Does that do anything? Not really. Not gonna lie. Doesn't do much. But we could leave that there. We could also... I, was, I had this in my hand before, but we could also... Maybe... Instead of... These. Put these up the front. Open up this to kind of look a little bit more... It's not the worst. Those might be more like a thing that we can put up the back, actually, because I think I've seen some similar-esque stuff on some tanks. The back. So yeah, you guys basically get the idea of my like work process and stuff, just fiddling around with it. And basically, on a larger scale, I can build stuff like that. <laughs> Okay, so this is future Jacob. Um, past Jacob made the mistake of turning, uh, finishing the recording before he was done because he just was like, yeah, this is probably a boring video. But you know what? Let's, you, you clicked on the video. You want to see me finish the tank. I mean, why not? Um, so, uh, since I last cut off, I actually uh, got some custom player heads. So we got a light, um, traffic light yellow, and we've got a wheel design. Because uh, custom player heads, you can uh, get like any um, Minecraft player's heads in the game with some commands. So I got these two, and I'm just uh, experimenting with using them here. So I was experimenting with the zombie heads a second ago, because I wasn't entirely happy with how this was turning out. Because um, I removed... I had these here, and I removed those. I don't know. Does it look better with nothing there? Better with this there? Or better with the wheel ones? I don't really like it with these here. These look too blocky in a way. That looks pretty good though. Maybe I'll just leave it like that. These, I'm not really sure that's the appropriate shape to make it, but it's not bad. Yeah, I don't know. I'm still contemplating what to put right there. I'll probably just leave it like that. But these uh, look much better than the uh, previous headlights that I was using. We've got zombie heads, but I can... Well, put this in there. Yeah, and that, that makes it look a lot more like an actual vehicle. So I haven't changed much since I cut away. I actually swapped these trapdoors to these ones. Because these kind of have a, a nicer shape for it. I'm not really usually a big fan of these jungle wood trap doors, but they seem to be doing all right in this particular build. This is pretty much where I think I'm going to leave it. I'm actually pretty happy with this little tank design here. So uh, if you want to copy this in your own worlds, then you can kind of follow along with what I did, basically, it, just to kind of show you where to start the, uh, at the front here. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven wide. And then that's where you'd put these full blocks. But remember, they're full blocks, and you have to do this on a half slab thing. 
and then you go across blah 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 but you know down here then you can put the little overhang with the steps here and um, do the rest of the crap that I did like this this stuff with the um hoppers was uh, I'm pretty happy with that and yeah just mess around with the shape make it to whatever kind of tank design you want it uh, I was going for more like a World War II tiger tank sort of design is kind of vaguely what I had in mind because I wanted this to be like a, a tank that could have existed in the 50s because there's some really great designs for those modern like Abrams tanks and stuff like those desert tanks that I uh, you know you see a lot of maybe this will look better I kind of I, the shulker box kind of suits this design I think because it kind of looks like metal blocks or something but, you know, it looks like metal sheeting. I'll, I'll fix those little um, antennae in a sec. Or not antennas, whatever those things were. Maybe they were... Ah, you can use your imagination, I don't know. Yeah, see, this is what happens with me. I think I'm done with a design, and then I look at it again and go, Yeah, I could add this, I could add that, and it just goes on and on and on. But we can put these here. Like so. I don't know why. These could be, like, little guns I guess like maybe we could that looks really bad I don't know what I was thinking okay but um <laughs> okay we're done now guys this is the little um let's build a minecraft tank video and actually we're not done I still kind of feel the need to tweak would that look good or Hmm. Yeah, that's all right. <laughs> yeah, like I said, it's so so hard to just kind of be like, "Yep, it's done." But I'm gonna say that now. So there's my little Minecraft tank. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope um, this gave you guys some ideas for your builds, and uh, I'll be seeing you guys in the next video. So uh, if you have any ideas what you want me to build or you know come up with designs for then do let me know that in the comments below because it's super awesome when you guys do that and um yeah i'll see you guys around in the next video so um go away now bye